All right, we're getting you the details as far as the developments from the state of war Karnataka is concerned. Now, the ticket war essentially in the state of Karnataka continues. Here are the details of what's really happening as far as as far as uh, the BJP and the Congress now is concerned, uh, Congress is announcing a ticket to Savadi. Well, that's a big story. We're getting at this. Uh, a ticket to Savadi. Congress announcing a ticket to Savadi. This was along expected lines. Savadi is to fight from Athani on a Congress ticket. An embarrassment here for the BJP. But is it gain for the Congress? This was being speculated for the longest time that perhaps Savadi is going to be now joining the Congress party which he has. A ticket being given to Savadi, who's now joined the Congress party. This is now, comes as a setback to the BJP essentially, given that uh, he was associated and considered one of the taller leaders of the BJP in the state of Karnataka. Now he's going to be fighting on a Congress ticket is what is clear. That's the information that we have at this hour. Savadi to fight from Athani on a Congress ticket. Well, BJP leader, who was until the BJ with the BJP, uh, has previously hobnobbed with the Congress as well. It was evident and was being speculated that there is in fact a possibility of the Congress then taking him into the fold. Now it's clear that he is going to be contesting on a Congress ticket. Snubbed by the BJP, is it a gain for the Congress or not? What does he really bring to the party, Purva? Anaga? Well, what... What we do know is that there has been a lot of, uh, you know, talk after Savde uh, has uh, uh, put in his statement that he will be resigning from the Bharatiya Janata Party. In fact, he's also uh, expressed his displeasure time and again after he wasn't given a ticket where he says that he's a self-respecting and self-righteous uh, politician and that he will not go around and uh, be begging for a seat. That, that was the statement that in fact he had also given. Following that, now we're also expecting uh, that the former uh, Deputy Chief Chief Minister of Karnataka, Saudi, is expected to be joining with the Congress in just a short while from now. We do know that, you know, this comes up, this move from him comes right after, uh, you know, he had gone in and submitted his resignation uh, at the BJP there and he has uh, resigned from the BJP party as well. Uh, what we do hear from uh, BJP on one side is that, uh, you know, this is a mistake uh, uh, there and in fact there had been internal talks there uh, that were organized with uh, Mr. Savade himself, uh, but uh, saying that they will be giving him another uh, seat from another constituency or another region. But uh, remember, Athani, the place from where uh, Mr. Savade wanted to get his ticket and wanted to stand for in the uh, upcoming elections, uh, that was given to a different candidate as chosen by the BJP. And this is the very reason why he has also announced that he's uh, uh, displeased with the party's decision and also disappointed that he wasn't given the post that uh, the, the, you know, the okay. Okay. that he had uh, been contesting at and he's also uh, expressed that he will be quitting from the BJP shortly and joining the Congress. That's right. Apurva, be with us. Just coming back to you in a moment from now. In fact, uh, my colleague Sagar Raj has spoken to Arun Singh on the issue of Savadi joining the Congress. Now it's clear. Savadi is indeed contesting on a Congress ticket. Listen in to what Arun Singh had to tell us a while ago. Sir, the Supreme Court has also made a reservation about the reservation that you don't do any appointment until the 18th of the office. देखिए यह जो चार परसेंट रिजर्वेशन जो दिया था मुस्लिम को ये अनकॉन्स्टिट्यूशनल था किसी देश में किसी अन्य कोने पे ऐसा नहीं है उसको हटा करके दो परसेंट वकलीगा और दो परसेंट लिंगायत को देने का काम हुआ उसी प्रकार से एस समाज को पंद्रह से सत्रह परसेंट एस को तीन से सात परसेंट बढ़ा करके रिजर्वेशन देने का काम भाजपा की सरकार ने किया सर सऊदी आज कांग्रेस ज्वाइन कर रहे थे यही मैं कहूंगा भाजपा ने सब कुछ दिया जिस व्यक्ति को डिप्टी सीएम भी दिया कोर कमेटी में हारने के बाद कोर कमेटी में लिया है एमएलसी बनाया उनको ऐसा निर्णय नहीं करना चाहिए था इस ऐसे निर्णय करने से भारतीय जनता पार्टी के कार्यकर्ताओं को कष्ट होता है Karnataka and also statements have come in from very senior leaders like B.S. Edurupa, for example, Naga, 
who have come out and reiterated this, that we gave him everything. Savadi only benefited from being in the BJP, isn't it? Well, that's true. In fact, that's the sentiment of the BJP that the party gave everything to him. He was a part of the core committee. He was made the deputy leader in the council. He was made the transport minister even after losing his seat in 2018. What has he given back is what the BJP is asking. Now for his selfish reasons that he's gone back to Congress to fight in Athani constituency. Now the Congress also has announced ticket for uh, Saudi in Athani constituency against Mahesh Kumtali. We just heard Sidramaya and DK Shivkumar meet Mr. Saudi and say that there's no demand from him. He only... <laughs>